sitting here in the plant window in the house. Lunch is uh, pretty overloaded in the winter season, but uh, it's a lot of glass and uh, very little uh, building above it, so it's quite exposed. Which makes for a pretty good place to enjoy the hail. So, I have my little meditation cushion here under me. And if I do a little meditation, I'm gonna sit here besides the, uh, that's the pomegranate, the green in the foreground. I'm gonna set this in the planter. I'm just hoping that you're able to hear the hail, because that's kind of the whole point of being here. I don't have much of a meditation planned. I changed my mind. I think you're going to go in the grapefruit tree. I've been out since well before dawn, and shoveling and plowing. It's uh, very blizzardy and the giant snowflakes. Uh, and very windy and then very squally, snowy. And then a couple minutes of rain and now hail for the last little while. Oh, sleet, there was some sleet and then hail now. I'm just inside to shift into um, some dry clothes and have a sip of tea and think about heading back out. And it's nice to enjoy the hail. I did get outside and you can hear it with the metal roof, but I think it's too windy that you must have been hearing the wind and the microphone noise. So I'm just trying to uh, feel here how sound is surrounding you. And to think of sound as being in front of you, that's where your ears are made to hear it. Uh, you know, not being um, prey. Uh, our ears tend to be uh, directed in the same way that our eyes are. Whereas a prey animal will have its ears to be able to hear behind it, and certainly often articulating ears. But one of the consequences that we tend to think of the sound is being when we're looking. <clears throat> of course, we know that's not true, but being in this little amphitheater of hail, I'm just trying to become aware of how there's hail happening over here uh, where I don't hear it in the house. It's the bulk of the house that direction. It's not just here. sound is just a pressure wave in the air, propagated through the air, same as ripples on a pond. So every sound is like the wind. See a lot of branches and vines dancing outside. My view is outside through that side window here in the plant window.
I'm actually leaping back a little bit. My back is fairly sore. Find some support here. Normally, I'd be sitting over here like this. So I'm just trying to tune into the oral landscape, even beyond what I actually hear and actually beyond what I listen to, consciously or unconsciously. And that the sound continues after the wave has passed me. In most cases. And the sound is there before it gets to me. So the sound is not limited to where I am. My relationship to it, my experience of it is not my mental surmisals of it, which seem like experience. The wind chime, some of the wind chimes picking up. Okay, it seems like the wind just calmed for a little bit and the hail sound is quieted. I'll introduce you to the, there's a banana and coffee plants there. And uh, 